Hello, my name is Lily White and I'm the Director of Hospitality here at University Baptist Church. We are so excited about offering another option for worship. This Sunday on November 1st, we will have a one-time in-person service outdoors. Now, if you're not feeling well or you don't feel comfortable coming together, not to worry, we'll still be live streaming our worship service so you won't miss a thing. Now, in a few minutes, I will take you around and let you know what you can expect when you come to church on Sunday. So stay tuned for that. If you would like to worship with us, we ask that you answer three questions found on our website. You can find that in the description of this video. Now, come with me and I'll take you around so that you can know what to expect when you arrive on Sunday, November 1st. When you arrive, park in the garage as usual, then walk down 22nd Street to Guadalupe. If you're uncomfortable managing stairs, we'll have the alley entrance open for you. Just head on through and head to the courtyard. We'll have a hand sanitizing station there. If you are able to take the stairs, we ask that you head to the Guadalupe entrance. That way we can limit the number of people that are coming in through the building. When you arrive for the service, we ask that you wear your masks. If you don't have one, we can provide one for you. We also ask that you wear your mask throughout the service. If you don't feel comfortable doing that, it would be best to join us online. At this entrance, we'll have masks and a hand sanitizing station. There will be an usher to tell you which seat to take. Chairs will be placed in the gravel area and will be spaced six feet apart. The chairs will have numbers on the back so you can find your seat quickly. It's important for us to know how many people will be in your group so we can plan for the seating accordingly. If you haven't RSVP'd with us, please make sure to do so by using the link in the description of this video. It will be so nice to see each other and pass the peace of Christ through a wave. Please remember, we'll need to keep a safe distance so we can protect each other. We won't have bulletins printed, so if you want to follow along, you might want to download it on your phone or tablet before you arrive. We'll email it to you in the Ways to Worship email on Friday. If you would like to give to the church, we ask that you send your payment through the mail or electronically. We won't have collection stations at the church. We will have our restrooms open. They'll be available through the alley entrance. You can go into that lobby and use those restrooms. We will also have hand sanitizing stations in the foyer. After worship, we'll be exiting from the back row forward. So please stay in your seat until it's your turn to move. You'll also want to exit the same way that you came in so that we can utilize all the exits for everyone. Remember, we're worshiping outdoors in November, so it could be windy and chilly like it is today, or it could be sunny and warm. Make sure to dress for the weather. Bring a sweater or a hat and sunglasses. And it's as easy as that. We hope that you're enjoying our live stream services and that you're finding meaning and connection there. We look forward to the time when we can all gather together safely. For now, Amelia, Jonathan, Paul, Arnold and I hope that you'll join us if you can on Sunday, November 1st. Until then, God bless you and have a great week.